All right, Trinan, to be good. So I'm back with you on the street now on NFM. And I'm going back to the phone lines. I'm going straight back to the phone lines because I know that we don't have much time on the radio. So I'm going back on the phone on the phone lines. So you can join me on Facebook and on YouTube, right? I'm going to the phone lines. Hello, good afternoon. Yeah, I'm going to you. Pastor Wubel. Hey, what's happening, oh. Mr. Kingsley, sir? And uh, I'm blessed by God, not by man or woman. Pastor Wubel, I want to start off saying that um, he was very professional this morning. He did not run down in the mud. Like what he tried to do you this morning and attack you. How God make you now and how God create you. The same way he tried to attack me about how God make me about my speech. And, I, and everybody know that King Z is just a stomach. I don't know if or maybe. Like, he now know I just a stomach because when I used to call his program, I never used to call a stomach. Mm. But I call it, no, he now know I just a stomach. I want him to hear this, right? But I wouldn't go down in the mud because I'm the other sick child. I wouldn't do that. I wouldn't go down in the mud because laughing at somebody as child and the William and, and watching the mirror. I wouldn't go in Kelly Village. I wouldn't go and say who woman and who woman I have outside. I wouldn't go down that road. But I put you on notice. I put you on notice. And no Kelly Village. I put you on notice and the Williams. I know Kelly Village. I put you on notice. I, I wouldn't say that I went in in different country with 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 woman. I wouldn't say I do that. I wouldn't say I do that. So I put you on notice. See that how you want to go down the road. And I talked about my speech, I know I talk how God made me. I want to say that again, Andy, you have a sick child. I wouldn't go down that road with you. But I want to say, I want to thank Andy Williams and all for coming and say this morning that the pushback movement, it is not a protest group, it's a praying group. Because Andy, I wouldn't go down in the mud because there's questions to answer. And I hope that you could answer it because I'm, because I'm going to ask the question. Because what the mayor say to ask you, who is the pundit coming to preach? Who is the pastor? Who is the bishop? Who coming to preach you? Who will be the preachers? The men who is the leaders of the ground movement. So we will be calling on the police to monitor that and walk to see that if anybody have one, my church, your church, because it began to be no sign of that any church you have about my church, your choice, is not a prayer. So if so if no so if if no that the one of day and it's, it's in a prayer. And then we hear the must go. We will not say now we must go. My vaccine, my choice. It's that's praying. That is praying. 
that that is praying. So that is praying. And what and wanted him Mayor, he dropped the ball. He dropped the ball because why? The Catholic pressure. The Catholic pressure. People can't call it in. They get frightened. So you have to call in on a program. Because why? You're afraid. You're afraid. I call on the time. Huh? Hello? Go ahead. Yeah, I call on the Prime Minister of this country. And also call on the mayor, on the minister of local government to look in to the mayor San Fernando. I believe that he's a mole. He said he's there. Because it was too far. Because that's that what I said. That he is a mole. And I call him on the minister of local government and also the Prime Minister to intervene in this. Because how you can tell me one minute you're running people from praying up there. Police are all kind of thing. Lock up individuals. But now you get permission to a UNC group, to a B team, to a political group. Do you know do let be real? These talk shows are known you only talk shows because they label you as a Google as a PLM. But everybody know, everybody know. So as a close, because Pastor Google, I come today, I, I just say Paris must go in, but I will go over that for next week. I will go over that, that for next week, because Paris name calling in too much of Pastor Pastor, them say this, this thing, because, because why say them Pastor Google? The UNC leave me, I never leave the UNC, and I never join in the PNM, so I could talk, I want to say it again. The UNC leave Kingsley. Kingsley never leave the UNC. And Kingsley never join in the PNM so Kingsley could talk. So next week, I'll be calling on Paris to go and they stand up. And you will hear why. So as I close, I want to thank you, Pastor Google, again for just responding to individuals who trying to libel and scandal the name. You play the clip. The question, and I will be me, I was just saying, there, there was no sign that that in a day of press, the way he was going up before. Vaccine. That would be the same vaccine. Who lost jobs? Who the government fired? Who were what? Who in feed? Who hungry? Who was this? Let's say it is that. Why are you go hide and hide it and using God's name? Why are you using God's name and calling somebody that? Therefore, why are you using God's name? And you know it's a put it's, it's a political test, it's a it's a protest to remove Really? Why were you hiding? That is my point about it. If if, if we know we are against the government, come out and say we are against the government. Again, I call on the Prime Minister, the minister the minister of local government to call in to call in that mayor, that mole, that mayor from San Fernando, that mole, that mole is a mole. And and I and, and, and I I can expose them. If I was a PNM, I would expose them, you know. But I leave it up to the PNM because I want to hear them, you know. Because he not went to defend Pastor Google. The Pastor Google defend me yesterday. Defend the PNM. And he went to chop up Pastor Google here. That we do, 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 He do, 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 because why he is selling a party, what he believes in, what he is he, 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 he understand. So that may have possible goal. What he did there this morning, is that very, it was, it was a real or other time and thing, but he shouldn't do that. He said, what he is doing this, do this, do this, and he called in it. He never wait for the people to call him. He called in. That may have called in. That mole may have. That, this, that, that, that agent. Oh, that agent. Hi, Kingsley. Hello, good afternoon. Hi, good afternoon. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Yes, Pastor Google. As a believer, you have to disregard these people. No, I can't disregard those people. All right, let me let me finish now. And um, I want to tell you that according to Psalm one thirty nine fourteen. It says that um, you are fearfully and wonderfully made. All right? God made you for a purpose. God loves you. So regardless of who 
criticize you and, and there is a Bible, you need to get it and, and, and preach it to them that talk about complaining and criticizing. Jesus don't like these criticizing and complaining. You are a child of God. And then another scripture talk about the battle is not yours. The battle is God. Remember, the, the, God went through a lot of these things. And he looked to his father for help and guidance. So I would tell you, leave it up to the Lord. They will fall in their own time and space. God loves you. You do what you have to do. Don't fight with them. It don't make sense. That's the devil would. All right, the devil is out there. All right, the devil is a liar. All right, what the Lord said to do, resist the devil. Resist, and the devil will flee. Amen. Thank you. So good for a COVID-19 update. And then we're going to come back. When I come back, I have some more things to say, you know. Yeah, I have something I want to get off my chest. I'm going to get it off my chest. So I've already passed on the relevant information. So who I need to pass it on to. So we're going for a COVID-19 update. And then we're going to come right back and continue to take your calls. Right here on the street, 919-FM. This is the Street 919 FM COVID-19 updates. In case you missed it, the latest COVID positive cases in TNT as of February 3rd, 2022. Stands at new positive cases, 638. Total active cases, 19,860. Total recovered patients, 90,068. Total positive cases for COVID-19 as of March 2020 to present, 113,317. Follow the Ministry of Health COVID-19 protocols. Wear your mask, sanitize, social distance, and avoid gatherings. A message from The Street 919 FM. Entertainment, information, conversation. All on Street 91.9 FM. The official station that defends the nation.
coming down from Karina Shea and the song is a tribute to um, singing Sandra forever well I hope that you enjoyed it I enjoy playing it for you and um, you're listening to constructive talk with me Pastor Google and um, today was an interesting day for me so today was a very 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 interesting day and I Hope that you know 
<laughs> people, people, boy, human beings. I'm going to the phone line. So, good afternoon. Good afternoon, Pastor Google. How are you today? I am all right. All right, you need to be all right. However, concerning the, the caller, sometime before that, speak about regard, disregard. I sure should have called in the other stations and tell them to disregard certain things. However, these people who call in about their prayer was their leader. We know it is politically motivated. It was their leader who said prayers don't do nothing, so I don't know who they're trying to fool. Hmm. And secondly, I wouldn't even beat up on Junior too much. Maybe get a pan in the head sometime this week, walking up and down in the pan yard. And that prayer on the promenade, that is only necromancy. All this rubbish about all these different churches who come in. Rubbish. And we all know it's politically motivated. So them could rock with that. Have a good day. Thank you very much. Put a hand. These wicked people. Huh. Often times. Life is so hard. Trust me, I know that. Trust me, I know that. And often. Hello, good afternoon. Good afternoon, Pastor Google. Good afternoon. Pastor Google, this is Eccle, I'm dead and gone. But you know why he chose the valley here? Because he know it will have another snakes in the PNM party. Say no more. And that gentleman was talking such a nonsense. God will answer him in due cause. Because I don't know how he can say the prayer to God after he done say all these certain nasty things. And when he done it, say go and talk to God. God will answer them kind of battle from Peso. Because he's not a battle from God. He's a just God. Okay? Thank you. God bless. Okay. Hello, good afternoon. Good afternoon, Pastor Google. From hey. that people saw there and heard this morning. This is a person who believes that he's a blank man, as a woman had said. And he hates his mother for bringing him to be a black man onto this earth. And if he hated his mother, he also hates God. So he doesn't know anything about God and and people into this world. For the description how he was carrying on about a black man, he feels he is not black. So that means he's hating mother. Okay? So don't bother with some of them when they see. I mean, it's something hurtful. I shouldn't say you really shouldn't bother with them. But it's to see how much they hate themselves. A blank woman tell them about black and since then, all of them hate themselves and saying they're black, and they don't want to be black. They want to be like blank people. Okay, then. Thank you. All right. Hello, good afternoon. Good afternoon. Uh huh. Yes, sir. You remember when the mighty Sparrow sing his father's stage? You know why they sing that? When Nain Naya used to put, in a school, used to put. Men in, in the kennel, right? And up to now, they in pass, they so shame. See, now in now, they so shame. This Toyota man who put, put, in, put in African man in cage like dog and call him dog. All right, hello, good afternoon. Good afternoon again, Patrick. I don't know how, how, anyhow. I sure I never see you drunk and staggering, you know, big yellow sneakers. So keep that as a plus. You're sober and you're right thinking. And I know you personally. Have a good day. Thank you. Pastor Google, good afternoon. This is something I have to get off my chest for a very long time. I worked right on the promenade and I see him here well, lots of times. And that man do ever tell you the time of the day. If you tell him it, he would not answer. All he do is walk with his head high up. And he do not tell people the, the morning, the afternoon, nothing. That man have no manners. And I promised him to tell him about it one day. I saw him last week. I said good morning to him. He never answered. He was on the phone. And I'm promising next time, as there's a God above, I'm going to tell him he do not have any manners for me. Thank you. Brother, good afternoon to you and to your listeners. I'm going to touch on this very quickly. 
My brother, you are fearfully and wonderfully made. And big brother Google, believe you me, when I say I love you, I love you. And let me tell you something. Let people talk and let them say what they want about you. I know you. And you, you, is make a difference. You are making a difference. You are making a difference far more than these guys who sit behind a desk and run AC whole day. Right? And who have to come in front of a camera to say they're making a difference. In my book, continue doing what you're doing because God will reward you and he will reward you openly. God bless you, my big brother, and be safe and reach home safe. Love you much and have a great weekend. Same to you. Thank you. Hello, good afternoon. Hi, good afternoon, Pastor Google. I just want to give you a little joke. My little goddaughter told me once, um, Uncle, everybody just call her fat and she's so sad. I say, Gil, don't worry. To maintain the size, you have to have a little bit of money to maintain the size, you know. Because you can't be at this size and then eat it. And we had a good laugh at it. So he's hungry and he's looking for a living. Go take he on. Secondly, and I'm going to say something a bit controversial, but not to bring the radio into dispute. Wall Street. He says things, he may say it out of context and out of timing, but what he says makes a lot of sense in the terms of just like the mayor, they do help us and they need to help us because we just put all there. They just always try to help somebody else. I'm not sorry to say it, but I know how to say it. So have a good day. Jesus, Lord, put a hand. These wicked people. Oftentimes, life is so hard. Trust me, I know that. Trust me, I know that. Know Hello, good afternoon. Good afternoon, Pastor Google. Good afternoon. Um, uh, in life, as you know, and being a pastor yourself, um, sometimes you, um, you wish you are quite right. Um, um, God, pleasing God is the most important thing, as you know, okay? And, um, I know you're stronger than that. And whatever reference I made, it wasn't to you in the past. It was to another pastor, um, that I was referring to. But in time when I see you personally, I will let you know what had happened and transpired. It wasn't you directly, right? Um, but I just want to let you know that. And as according to um, the brother who spoke there just now, Andrew, um, he's quite right. Um, you are loved and respected by everyone. And it's unfortunate that in our living years, people, most people don't recognize the good work God has placed us with as a purpose like yourself and many others. Um, it's only when they passed on, they would say, you know, be a hypocrite and say how good you were. You know, that is, we have, we entering that part of our culture is being retrospective, you know, and, and not proactive. We, we are, um, we, we are retroactive and not proactive. But the main thing, as you know, as your pastor, is what God thinks of us. And in your eyes and your wife and many people, right thinking people, you are good looking and handsome to only handsome and good looking people, not ugly people. Blessings to you and your family and the rest in, in the radio station. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Yeah, Google, don't take on them fellas, boy. Them is the equivalent of what they just call them in America, coons, Uncle Tom. Yeah. You know? That's a thing for the supper, boy. Hello, good afternoon. Good afternoon, Pastor Google. Good afternoon. Yeah, you know, I want to thank you for all the work that you have been doing, the tireless job that you have been doing for the PNM and for the citizens of this country. And don't let no negative person get it down. Have some people in this country, Pastor Google, believe they could disguise themselves as all kind of woman, try, who try, who try, and hold all kind of march and all kind of protest and disguise the protest. But we all know it's against the government. 
But when you go get through, because the people constitutionally put Dr. Rory and the PNM there, and not run into no courthouse, and no march, and no push back or push forward, what they do could change that. And I hear a man bashing you on the radio talking about you have to travel up and down the road and all them kind of things. You're traveling, but hear what I want to tell that fella this morning, this evening. You traveling past the Google, but you know what? You have honesty, you have character. Nobody never made no attempt on your life. And let them tell you why they make an attempt on them life before they start to judge you. Pastor Google, you keep up the good work. I look for that listening, brother. Thank you very much. Hello, good afternoon. Yeah, good afternoon, Pastor Google. All I could tell you, boy, is stay strong, boy. Stay strong. Right? Because you see, you see, that, you see the type of hypocrisy I see in this country, boy? You want that deceitfulness? It is very toxic, boy. It is, it, 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 to the point that I totally fed up with some of these people. They're coming in different form, different styles. You know, opposing for opposing six. They can't please people in this country, you know. Right? And sometimes... There are times that, you know, I know you feeling you as a, as a certain radio host. I know you'll probably tell yourself, take your, take your package and just go, yes, and take a long vacation. I right now feeling how the Prime Minister feeling right now. If I were the Prime Minister, I would probably say, you know what? Um, Easy come, easy go. Open up, this, op, open up the country and who they're dead. That's how I see things. Right? And if to call, call, stop election and all this like somebody else because it's like, well, you don't want to wait until 2025 for election for generation to come out. Or you have local government elections. If the activists and them who come out with these so-called push forward thing, go up and, and, and contest seats in local government elections now. That all you have to do. And we will, sh- and we will know who all you for because all they say, all you're not UNC or you're not apolitical. We will find out what's happening in local government elections. That's all. Pastor Google, you have a good day, yes? Hello, good afternoon. Hello, good afternoon, Pastor Google. Hi. Pastor Google, you are the best. Without you, I don't, I don't, I can't come, I cannot function. I love to listen to you. Pastor Google, fat man is the best. I have my husband for 58 years now. And I've been since I 20 years. And he's still fat. And we're still going strong. So you stay right there and go strong and don't care about him. You understand? This is Mr. Santa Cruz. Hey, Miss Santa Cruz, how are you going? Good. You uh, going good, Pastor Gugu. You stay there. You stay there. From the time you hear 9 o'clock, we're watching for Pastor Gugu. Don't worry them. They don't like to hear the good things. They don't like the good things. Pastor Gugu, fat man is the best. Don't worry. Don't worry and ball head. <laughs> Thank you very much. So hear what I want to say to you, Trill and Tobago. And to the people who are listening and want to carry back the news. So, number one. I don't understand how you expect to win people when you attack people like that. So when you attack me or you attack people, you really think that you will be able to win over people? Number one, you ain't winning over nobody with that kind of mindset. And I want to see, and I'm saying it as clear, crystal clear. I come in. I come in, you know. You see, the internet radio station, the owner of that internet radio station, and that's putting on notice. I'm telling you straight up. I come in for you. All right? I come in. And you see that radio station further down the road from us? I come in. That's all I will see. I come in. Continue to call up my name. Continue to say what you have to say. Continue to do what you have to do. But I have a concern. Because if you stop a church from praying on the promenade, you stop them. The pastor was locked up. You hear me? You stopped a church from praying on the promenade. 
And now it's okay? I have a problem with that. I got countless messages after. I'm not going to say from who. But I got messages. One, the person said to me, Pastor Google, you need permission from the council to have any gathering on Harris Promenade. The person said to me, you cannot just come there and say you are praying. That is, the, what, that, is, that, that is two. And three, the person said to me, and you only apply for, you only apply to the police for permission when you are protesting. I hope that was clear. And the, and the source and the and who I got this from is very good source. I am not going to call. I see in it publicly, and because because you sent me, they sent you sent me on to, to get in contact with you. I'm not calling no minister of local government. You see that back and forth, me going through that. I just want to let you all know and listen to what's happening. Be aware of what's going on in Trinidad and Tobago. I call. The mayor of San Fernando, whole evening, Wednesday evening, afternoon. Never give on to him. Understand? Yesterday, I had to call him. But this morning, he called a UNC show to clear up that it's okay for them to come and pray on the promenade. You hear me? Trinidad and Tobago. Supporters of the People's National Movement. And I will say it again. I sat here for, for, for 10 to 9 years and gained salt, gained abuse. 4 p.m. Get costs. 4 p.m. And I laugh it off. People who work in here cost me. 4 p.m. People who still work in here. People who just come and pretend... As though they're apolitical or they're not for party or they're not for, 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 for whatever. People just come and pretend to you. I don't pretend to you. I don't come here and talk Bible and <laughs> to you. And then behind your back, cutting you up, playing games with you. I don't play games with you. You could never say, Trinidad and Tobago, I play games with you. It at times you all were against me for some of the positions that I take. And people want to come now, boy. A man take a whole morning show and cuss me. Say the worst things about me. And that's just on a morning show. On our internet radio station, whole program is about me for talking the truth. I want to tell you, Trinidad and Tobago, people who you think must laugh at you, they're laughing with you. At least we just battle it out. At least I will disagree with you. At least I will stop here and I will discuss with you. It are people who you laughing with, talking to, and they hate you. And you know what? You're very forgiving and acceptable. I accepting them, sorry. But you see the ones who straight up with you? And who you know? Who you can see through? And you can know? Those are the ones, boy, that you all don't like. 
So while people will watch me going for a water taxi, going for the bus, taking a taxi, and saying, watch, he talking for the PNM, and look, he's still traveling. You don't know if I'm traveling by choice, but you're all up in my business. Mind your own business, you know. What's your business, you know, Bridget? You want to see I traveling? You want to talk about me traveling? Go ahead and talk about me traveling. Go ahead. Talk. Come back after this. From the studio to the stage, every Friday between 3 to 4 p.m., right here on the street, 919 FM, radio you can see. Log on to our Facebook and YouTube so you can see live interviews and performances from some of our very own local superstars. Right here on the street, 919 FM. Shop at New City Mall and check out our premium selection of high-quality clothing and accessories for men and women. Save on all items with competitive prices and courteous service throughout the entire mall. New City Mall is located in the heart of Port of Spain with entrances at 3 Charlotte Street and number 41 Independence Square. We offer a variety of shirts, long and short sleeve, round and v-neck tops, vests, caps, hats, sunglasses, briefs, boxes, shorts, swim trunks, denim, jeans, long and three quarters, socks, sneakers, casual and athletic, shoes, dressy and fashionable, dresses, formal and casual, skirts, lingerie, undergarments, and a wide range of accessories. Come check us out as we also have clothing and accessories like Levi's, Clarks, Armani Exchange, Hollister, American Eagle, Ralph Lauren, Nike Air Force and Air Max, Puma, Adidas, Timberland, Academics, Aeropostale, Old Navy, Forever 21, Haynes, Dockers, Guess, Converse, and so much more. We have barbers, hairstylists, as well as weave and wigs on sale. All at New City Mall. Like us on Facebook and follow us on Instagram. Sale, sale, sale. There's a new taste in town. Maracas Bake and Shark at 79 Robert Street in Woodbrook brings you Bake and Shark, Kingfish, Fries, Shrimp, Alpine, and delectable sauces to tease your taste buds. Walk in, order with Food Drop, or get parking lot pickup at 488 Bake or 75 Shark. Need catering? No problem. Call or email tastemaracas at gmail.com. Follow Taste Maracas on social media for all the delicious details. Taste Maracas, the new taste in town. Corner of Roberts and Rosalino Streets. See you soon. Every Friday, it's all about Firewood Soccer Fridays with MCU Consulate Takochi from 6 straight to 9 p.m. Blazing all the latest and past soca hits. So remember, make it a line, make it a day, rock and come in. You know. It's all about Firewood Soccer Fridays on the Street 919 FM. Don't know. Hey guys, it's Aisha Wells here. Listen up. If you're considering selling or renting your house in Trinidad and Tobago, then call Keelan George with O'Neill's Real Estate Group. He's a good friend of mine and he's been in the business for over six years. First, selling real estate in Atlanta, Georgia, and now right here in Trinidad and Tobago. He has a strategic online marketing presence that actually attracts thousands of home buyers and renters. Plus, with his home selling advice and techniques, he's getting homes sold really fast. Kilan will actually guarantee you sell your home or, get this, you can cancel the listing agreement and pay nothing at any time. That's right, you heard me, nothing at any time. Selling your home doesn't have to be stressful, people. Check out www.oneilrealestatet.com. O'Neill is spelled O-N-E-I-L or just call Kilan direct at 363-4030. That's 363-4030. 
This is Wayne Delamore, Head Consultant and Director of Natural Health Solution. With over 15 years of experience in clinical nutrition and microscopy, we specialize in early detection and prevention. We incorporate evidence-based nutrition and science-driven analysis. Tune in to our educational program every Wednesday at 9.05 to 9.55 a.m. right here on the Street 91.9 FM. For appointments, call 222-2189 or 304-5816. At Natural Health Solutions, we offer a natural solution to healthy living. If you're experiencing pain, constipation, headaches, or blood circulation, high or low blood pressure, diabetes, cancer, swollen, or darkened feet, come visit us at Health and Wealth Lifestyle, located at 73 Eastern Main Road, Barataria, opposite Eastern Credit Union. We at Health and Wealth Lifestyle offer a wide range of services. Come and experience our new 3D analyzer, which allows you to have a look inside your body. We also provide live blood analysis, iridology, ionic foot detox with foot soap and foot massage, aqua therapy, full body massage, and organic supplements on sale such as nano silver, nano zinc, body light, cold press sesame oil, and more. Health and Wealth Lifestyle, located at number 73 Eastern Main Road, Barataria, opposite Eastern Credit Union. For more information, call 275-8359 or 288-1108. Join Nicole Huggins for Health and Wealth Lifestyle every Monday from 9.05 a.m. to 9.55 a.m. right here on the street, 919 FM. This is Bishop Aaron Williams from the Divine Problem Solving International Ministries inviting you to be part of our broadcast on any given Thursday night from 12 midnight right on to 5 a.m. on Friday morning. And this broadcast is called Early Morning Gospel Market Program. Then we have on Tuesday from 12 noon to 1 p.m. the Holy Ghost Gospel Pharmacy. If you are sick and ailing, you can get from this particular pharmacy from the pharmacist the good things of life. Hallelujah. And any Saturday from 10 a.m. to 12 noon. Break into the host of the Philistines. Hallelujah. If you are sick and tired of being sick and tired, hearing the Babel of false doctrines that you encounter daily, it's about time you get close to God. God's word direct from his throne room in the name of Jesus. God has good plans for his people. Why do you worry so much? Turn your lights down low and listen to the master's radio the church of the firstborn assembly of numbers 399 eastern main road guaico sangri grandi is pleased to present pastors morris and agnes johnson and guest sundays tuesdays and friday night sunday ministry of worship Children Hour and the Word from 1 p.m. to 6 p.m. Tuesdays, see Jesus in every book of the Bible from Genesis to Revelation from 9 p.m. and Friday night, 9 p.m. to 5 a.m. All night prayer for our nation. Tell your neighbors, tell your friends, tell everyone. For further information, visit with us at www.churchofthefirstbornassembly.org or on Facebook. Email us at church. Church 668 Hope at gmail.com or call us at 753 1113 or 236 7271. Your free gifts and offerings will be greatly appreciated at Church of the Firstborn Assembly, account number 795222 at the First Citizens Bank. In touch with God. Share the line. Share the line. The Street 919 FM on Facebook and Instagram. Share the line. Iowa George on Instagram. Share the line. Iowa TV and Street Street TV on YouTube. Share the line. The Street 919 FM. Jesus, Lord, put that hand. These wicked people. It's so hard, trust me, I know that Trust me, I know that And often times You can't seem to find any motivation It's only frustration But I can't afford to slow the pace No, it's not time to lose the faith One thing I know, mommy, race a fighter, fighter But mind the people want me fail But each time I fall, I rise again Then I get in that satisfaction, yeah Joy from me, no way. That's why I'm doing 
song by um by terry lyons i really like this song you know how oh, they try they try they can't steal my joy i'll tell you this should and to be going and i'll go back to the phone lines and give you all the rest of the program to call either and tell me what are your views but um it's interesting very interesting very very interesting again i will put it out there and i played it so you all know it's a fact i'm not making it up me making it up is a fact it's a fact that i sit here every day and i talk to you guys play you guys clips hear your views disagree with your views agree with your view sometimes we even share my view let's just let you all talk sometimes i will disagree and and from the time i disagree you know arrogant or cocky or this or that whatever whatever but at the end of the day what you see is what you get with me i'm not playing games with you i tell you as it is but i'll say this boy I would try my best to, you know, inform the listeners. Um, I, I, anybody out there who who surprised at the announcements that even <laughs> if you don't know that I will I and I'm and I'm saying it publicly presently. The UNC. I could never sit before a microphone and endorse the UNC. I must be Sasa. I'm sorry. I cannot do it. I cannot. I do have the belly to do it. I might have plenty of belly, as the man say. But I do have the guts, boy, to sit here and fool you. And tell you I will support Miss B. Sasa. Or support the UNC. How I can support a woman who call me a Rawan. Or somebody who look like me a Rawan. How I can support a woman who watch somebody who look like me. Black. The black man. And countless things. How I could do that. I'm sorry I can't do that. And whoever want me to do that or whoever want to do that, that is their prerogative and their business. But I can't do it. I 
And let me tell you this, eh? And I'm going as far, I'm going all out now and say this. If you get from the PNM, they say you're talking for your supper. Listen, eh? Listen how life is, eh? If you get from the PNM, oh, he only talking because he get something. If you do get, the slaves watch, watch, they're talking and they ain't getting nothing. All of that is to find out if you're getting it. <laughs> All of that is to know, to, to throw in bait to see how you will respond to the wanting to know if you're getting something, if you ain't getting something. That's one. Two. You see more? When I'm when I am convicted about something or believe in something or you know want to stand up for something, I, I will do it despite whoever say what. And I'll bring this back up. And after this, I'll open up the phone lines. I remember when the PNM had internal elections. For Dr. Rowley to be the leader. Well, there were to, for, for them to get a leader. Penelope, Minister and Member of Parliament for San Fana, for um for Arima, Miss Penelope Beckles went up for leadership. I was the only radio announcer. Who supported Miss Beckles? Everybody else was supporting Dr. Rowley. I wouldn't I seen it as calm and as cool and as collective. Everybody in this radio station supported Miss supported Dr. Rowley. If a lion Sharon could call in, Aisha could call in and say Google a lion. I was the only one. I went to every single broadcast all over Trinidad and Tobago with Miss Beckles. And I supported Miss Beckles. After the internal elections went away and Dr. Rowley became leader, I said, I will have to support Dr. Rowley as leader. Yeah, man. And that's why I said to you earlier today, two things black people suffer with. Bad, 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 bad. We forget very fast. Let me tell you how we forget very fast. Somebody will come on this station here and will we'll, we'll see the worst things about the listeners and, and about black people and about what and what and what and what. I know some of you all will rah, 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 rah. no, oh, you're going to have that man on the radio. La, 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 la. Let that man stay off the radio for two years. That same man could come back here and sit down and many of you will forget And if he's saying what you want him, if you if he's saying what you want to hear, you will act, you will forgive him, and you will take him up like if he's ghoul. Yeah, I'm saying to you. And 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 I could bring back the same UNC and the same people who touting about right now. To get your vote and your support. They want to get your support, you know. But here they're talking about a black man like me. Black brothers. Here they're talking about me. There's a young man on the live right now. An East Indian young man. If you go on to his profile... 
Chad, if you go into his profile and you see he want me to vote for who he's supporting. But look at the things he's saying on the live. So I have to be real stupid. And that's what I'm trying to understand. You have the worst things to say about people. The supporters of the UNC, the, the, the so-called talk show host and they. But then you, and you want me to come and dip my finger in ink to support you? Well, you serious? Are you serious? If I pull back some of the clips from the old school and play how hateful these people are about us, black people, and I must sit down here and laugh and let hello caller hello caller if that's what you want me to do I can do that very good you know you understand so all the Gavin and all the Richard and all of them who say and I crying on the live and I this and like that at the end of the day I work very hard for my little dust and God the stretch my little dust and I stand up for what I believe in. If that's what you believe in, then that's what you believe in. If you want to believe that crap, and you want to follow that crap, that is what you believe in. But is it for me? Not me. And to the detractors who want to know what little dust I get in, or if I ain't getting dust, that is my business, not yours. Other announcers could come and tell you what dust them does get or what dust they ain't gain or what if they gain dust at all. If you get dust, you're talking for your dust. If you ain't get dust, you're stupid, illiterate, dotish, they talk for no dust. And if you don't know, then you stay there and wonder if I gain dust. <laughs> But I want to tell the government one thing before I hand over to you all. Check the horns. Check the horns. You know there's a song like that? Check the horns straight on board. Check the horns. So I am going to give you the opportunity now to call in and share your views. 342-0081-771-1791. That's our WhatsApp number. And 466-5391. I'm going to the phone lines. Hello, good afternoon. My... My... Good afternoon, my fellow minister. Good afternoon, yeah. sir. How are you? Yes, sir. Well, um, don't worry. I am prepared to volunteer, as you know, we had spoken. So I was waiting on your call. And when I see these things happening now, I said, now is the ample time that I could say it broadly that I'm on your side. And it's time, you know, one of our, uh, our main person, the patriarch, he left us. But I visit him and we chat and so on and then. And I'm hoping that probably give me a call later, please, sir. All right, man. And we'll discuss things. Okay. Praise the Lord. Yeah. yeah. Hello, good afternoon. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. I don't know what is the full issue, but I joined maybe a, uh, 25 minutes ago, so I guess I just of what you're saying. I don't know um, exactly what the person said or whatever. But, um... You know, things, that, is, that is the thing about politics, and that's why I tell people I hold no party card and I don't want any. And I'm not going to say I don't want any, but I hold no party card at present. And you, you see, sometimes it's better you, you talk on what is best for the country and what is best for, for, for you know, people than 
go all the way political on one side because that is what it, that's what it turned out to be stuff time. Right? I don't know what the person said about it, but everybody is free to choose whatever political persuasion they they, they, they are want. But my thing is in the present um because I have I have no political party but I have a lean to the PNM because they are the only party that I see that think about the whole country rather than think about a certain segment of the country or certain um so, uh, I don't want to say race, but a certain people, a certain set of people, right? Or a certain area or something like that. I think PLM covers the whole country. But what is PLM problem? What is the problem with, with as I, as a person, start up watching it sometimes? It's because they don't, what and I always tell you that they don't say what they're doing, so people don't know. If you're from one area, you don't know what's happening in another area. And then people say you're not doing anything and whatever. So that is one of the problems with the PM. And then the other thing is that the people in that party is not, um, huh, what the correct word to use, not really devoted or, 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 huh. they, 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 they waver. They waver a lot. If somebody come and say something about them, they jump here, they jump there, if, 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 if they are members of the party, you know, they are members of the, uh, uh, the things with, with, with whatever following, whether they are bad guys or something. But if something is wrong, instead of they go into themselves and figure it out or deal with it in what they, they come and they start up, blah, 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 who are this and this and that and the other about you, yeah, the thing that you are a part of, and that is my problem, you are a part of it, you said you are a part of it. If you have a problem in your family or your children or whatever, you go by the neighbor, you go down the road and talk, 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 talk. No, you get inside there and you start to deal with it inside. And you don't say that is right. If somebody, if, if, if your family doing wrong or if your whatever you belong to doing wrong, come out and say, okay, this is a mistake. This is your mistake. Like, how are you talking about certain things, you know? I don't know what I'm um, saying, but... But it, it, that is wrong. It, it is like we're talking about the, the, the prayer in San Fernando. If, if it was wrong for one, it's wrong for the other one too. I don't know if it's because at that time there, it, it was what? More in the pandemic, what is their reasoning? And that is why I want to hear that is what people need to know. Okay, it, is, it was wrong for that group of people. Why it right now? Give us reasons. Why are you giving this? What, what is the difference between them and now? And what is the difference in what that one was doing and this one going to do? That is why you give them. Don't just do things and expect people to just accept it. And that is what I have a problem with. If you're any PNM and the PNM doing something wrong, you're supposed to be able to say, listen, I belong here, but this is wrong. Right? And deal with it in that way. And stop flip-flopping. I think here, they have too much of flip-floppers. And bad talkers are their own self. I never see people, well, group of people can bad talk their own self like, the, like that organization, the PNM. They bad talk themselves, they flip flop, they, they, oh, oh boy, it's terrible sometimes. They need to take a check out and re, re design or re right. okay. think about what they're doing. Thank uh, you. Good. Thank you. Hello, good afternoon. Good afternoon again, Pastor Google. Uh -huh. Pastor Google, I saw somebody post up. God is the reader of, of heart and the searcher of mind. And that is something God was to say. Eh? Yep. You understand? Pastor Google, I am saying it. God is watching over you. And no weapon form against you shall prosper in the name of Jesus. Covering you from the corner of your head to the sole of your feet. You understand? And who God bless, no man could. Okay, Pastor Google? Right. Have a blessed day and in Jesus' name, you'll be true soon. Okay. Thank you. Morning. When these racist UNC shows that are allowed daily, daily on the life, to spout the lies and the nonsense, when they make the crude comments, when they make the rude pronouncements, well, they don't say nothing. And when they get called out, they describe victimization. And a perfect example is today's self. 
Look, one of the racist shows on the live now spouting all kind of malfeasance against people. And one commenter make time to call him out for his racistness. He report me to Facebook and I block for two days, but that is not new. I don't live on Facebook. I don't get no money from Facebook. And when you report these people to Facebook, guess what? They don't get blocked. They don't get restricted. They don't get removed. You know why? Because most of them accounts are false, paid for accounts. So Facebook would not block the people who pay their money to keep the account alive. All you understand about Facebook. So once all they continue to allow them, they will continue to do what they do and be a nuisance, be rude, be crude, because they know they can get away with it because all they allow them to get away with it continuously. So I feel no sympathy when they do what they do. But I know how to deal with them. That same name you call is who report and blocking people when they oppose them on the live. If the host or the owners of the page don't stop and block and restrict these trolls from the life, they will continue. And when they continue, it gives them the opportunity to spout the brazenness, to spout the nonsense, to spout the hate, because they are allowed. If you do not stop them in the tracks early, they will continue continuously. All they seem to not to understand that, but go ahead and allow them. Pastor Guru, they have to fix that, you know. You see that confusion and that bacchanal we're going on there? We're going to know that he will be coming out of there just now, so he don't care what he do. Right? So you put in PNM in jeopardy. All right? That have to fix it up, Pastor Google. You see what they're doing to you there? That have to fix. It must fix. Pastor Google, good afternoon. <clears throat> you preach there just a little while. You preach there and say how it is. They're talking to you nice, nice, nice in front of your face, but behind their back, they're stabbing you with the dagger. I set an ungratefulness. They always want to know what you got to take. That time you're in there, you're not taking you're just doing it for the love of party, for the love of country, for the love of the goodness. Some of them feeding from the trough, wiping their mouth and pretending they didn't get nothing. Pastor Google is just like what happened here in Tobago. You had a man stand on a pulpit and say there'll be no justice for you. He hate the PNM. Eh? Um, all of them with the big red flag in their yard. He won the win the election. They will do for them now, Pastor Google. What happened to some of the same people that you talk about with the, the flag in the yard and they went and they vote for the PDP? So what they get in now? The backlash. Some of them crying and weeping. But I glad that this had happened. You see, all the snakes and them running out from the from the bodies eh, now. You see, all the snakes of Pastor Google, you are correct. And we are a set of ungrateful people. But here yeah, well, we like to forgive and we does forget. So thanks, Pastor Google, for opening up some of we eyes on what you are saying. So I locked on listening, darling, and me to him say from your water taxi, yeah? You meet to him say it and go with God. Politicians are like diapers and should be changed regularly on both sides. I trust no politician. Oh. Morning, Pastor Google. Go all the way and take down every one of them. I wonder where is Martin all of this? <laughs> this person on the live, they realize they're not taking them down. Yeah. Good afternoon, I, Pastor Google. Good afternoon. Sorry about that. Yeah, taking them down one by one. Pastor Google, where God bless no man curse. Thank you. And you are the head and not the tail. Mm. Pastor Google, the, and you said something just uh, it's, it's straight on board, song the horn, a straight on board. Song the horn, yes. The horn. And Pastor Google, I want to say one thing. It's have a man that's coming on your show. Whatever program you're carrying on. They say, I don't want to talk about this and I don't want to talk, but he advertising it. Hmm. 
every time you start to say, I want to talk about love and you cut it one time. Because that is not your come to talk to you. You're, you're promoting, you're only promoting every time you come on. Mm. Every time you come on, you're promoting. So you don't want no promoters on your show. You carry on your show for yourself, allow God to have his way with you. No devil, no demon could take your place. Thank and you. Have a blessed evening. Yes. Journey home safe. Hear yeah. you next week by God's will. Yes, thank you Bye very much. Bye bye. Hello, good afternoon. Hello, good afternoon. Caller. Call oi. <laughs> Call are you on? Hello, good afternoon. Good afternoon, Pastor Google. Pastor Google. Yes, sir. I wonder, I wonder if people want them to know that any time they touch you, they have to answer to the mad dog, my cool for you. <laughs> so let it, let it blah, 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 they mouth. Mm. These people and them are easy. They believe that these people and them will like them. My father was an Indian, and my father born me as a small little boy. Never trust them. But these so-called hungry black people, like what on the radio, the PP station, they, they see these people and them like them. But any time they touch it, they have to answer to me. Go ahead. All right. Hello? Hi, good afternoon. Yes, good afternoon, Pastor Google. Pastor Google, I know you are strong. And that is what we have to do. People die for their respect and what they believe in. Right? And Pastor Google, if you don't bring people on the radio and do your interview, you wouldn't know how they're thinking and how they behave after... So I'm glad that um, people come on and we know exactly. And, you know, sometimes they don't call back and say, you know, I've done that so and so. People swear on the Bible, right, when they're going to represent us in, in Parliament. They also swear on the Bible when they're going to court, you know. And people come to you and they swear to you they will repay you what you give them, whether in kind or, or financial um um, exchange, but they don't, some of them don't come back and say, here, this is what I promise you I would do and I would do it. So I'm saying, people, if you are strong like Pastor Google and hold on to what you believe in, nobody can say, listen, I buy you, or they can come to you and say, you must do that for me because here I have a picture recording of you and you must do that. Right? If you're in politics, I'm saying, forget everything else. You're in politics, all your business out there. All your business out there. If you don't want to go and represent people and be honest, and even if you do something in the past, so what? People make mistakes. Right? And if you cannot say, yes, I have done that, but that is in my past, and it's not so bad. Right now, I've changed my ways. Jesus has forgiven a lot of people. So... Do what you have to do. You can't come here and tell us, oh, I represent you and I'm going to do that and not under my watch and not under my whatever. And then you turn your back and you go, no, it can't happen. Have a blessed weekend. Thank you very much. Hello, good afternoon. Hello, good afternoon. Good afternoon. Yes. It's now two dinosaurs and have the most things to ensure your education and everything. <laughs> The calling from Matheson, I shall wait a letter. They don't know why Matheson, I shall wait a letter. How come you are calling to, to, to Matheson do a letter? I don't want I don't to call him no name. But how come you are asking for them to get a letter to the matter also? Nah, ma them, them, they like what I'm doing. You see what yeah, I'm oh, doing? Okay. They like what so, they are doing. They, yeah, you see, they you see those, them? those, those, those two dinosaurs that they're talking about there. You yeah. see, you see, you see what the what the the um the talk show host this morning did about me. They like that. Yeah. They like yes, that. Yes, yes. 
They yes. like them kind of thing. Yes. So so they wouldn't write Matt and tell Matt the same how they want Matt to get rid of, to, to, to write Aisha. They wouldn't no. want Matt to write them. No. And that is unfair. That is so unfair. It clearly tells you where their minds are. And, 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 and you see, when you all see them for who they are, you all need to stop listening to them and stay away from people like that. I don't anymore. I used to yeah. that, but I don't anymore. Stay I away from them. Yeah. That's why I like this song from Blacks. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Thank I you mean, very much. Hello, good afternoon. Good afternoon, Pastor Google. Who about talking to anybody? <laughs> you should have listened to the program from the beginning. Uh, sorry, I, 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 I woke in, so I don't always get a chance to log in. But uh, Pastor Google, listen up. I'm sorry that I want to really disturb your, your program, no? but I just want to make a little call to people who continue to be, I don't know, besides disruptive, but irresponsible in their behavior. Because while it has some people not dying from COVID, it has some people dying because of COVID. Well, listen to this. Listen to me. And I'm glad you said that. And I will join in with your, with your, with your discussion by saying yesterday. I went to, to, to take a taxi, right? And not in Port of Spain, in Crep. Because I went um, to, to check out Big Mike yesterday. Yeah. After I left from my Big Mike, from Aruka, I, I dropped out at Crep to get a taxi to go to San Fernando. And because I choose not to go into a taxi where a young lady is not wearing a face mask, hmm. You hear what I'm saying to you? Hmm. She refused. She she is not wearing a face mask. And I blatantly tell the driver, here yeah, what now drive. Count me out. I not I, I good. I had COVID. I know what COVID does. Yep. So you see that I ain't I ain't uh uh-uh, I good. But let me explain. You know, you know, you know, you know the driver had a problem with me. Back with you, yeah, yeah, yeah. He ain't back with you, no? No. But he back with you. Yeah. For wanting to do the right thing. And you know, but other passengers, when they realize that she doesn't have all her face mask, other passengers now started to come out of the vehicle. <laughs> well, now we go back with you more. <laughs> so I understand what you're talking about. But, but I, I endorse what you're talking about. For people who don't understand, let me explain something. Two Three people I know of, my uncle is one, the experience is you are sick with something else, but because the symptoms similar to that of some of the symptoms of COVID, they have to get a test for you before they start to treat you. And you know what? They die. Right? So the stupidness the people and I'm doing out here, causing people to death innocently. Maybe? You understand? Yeah, man. Uh-huh. Ready now, ready now. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh-huh. 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 Hear me now. I never bad mind nobody yet. I never fight down nobody now. I never try to stop nobody breath. That is not in my nature, no, no, no. I never see people with them things and vex them of it. Especially when they work hard for it. But they have some people, soon as they walk through your door, they put a stumbling block in your road, your road, your road. Your road, your road, your road. They practice evil. They think we don't know. And some of them close, they close, they close. They're close to your I don't care what no this is a this is a sermon 
This man preaching a sermon here. Yeah, 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 yeah. This man preaching a sermon. Hear me though. I never bad mind nobody yet. I never fight down nobody now. Nah. I never try stop nobody breath. That is not in my nature, yeah, no, no, no. I never see people with them things and vex them of it. Especially when they work hard for it. But it have some people, soon as they walk through your door, they put a stumbling block in your road, your road, your road. Your road, your road, your road. They practice evil. They think we don't know. And some of them close, they close, they close. They close to your Again to you, Pastor Google. <laughs> oh my gosh, my gosh, my gosh. Wow, 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 wow. What a, what a, a morning into the afternoon, Pastor Google, for <laughs> your program. I believe this was number. Well, so far it is number. It, it is, I don't know how Rita will go. But so far today, your program was the number one program on, 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 on 91.9 today. And I see a three something on the live, four something, it chop down to two something, two something now. They say, they say, it's all oh, like back and all. If you were saying a gospel song, I love you, Jesus Christ. They never come on, you know. And, because I Google it, yeah, in, your, in this hour, yeah, you, you give an opening editorial. And that opening editorial was very touchable, it was, was very right and on point. At that time, because and I want to judge on you by reminding you what they say. You said to the listening public, because they did us forget it. Eh? When you're on your radio, okay, let me make an example of me. Before the UNC leave Kings Day, and because Kings Day never leave the UNC, the UNC leave Kings Day. And them certain calls, you just call and say, um, I was the pioneer. You're talking for the you, you, UNC. And then giving you nothing. Look at you, black and shepherd. They're giving you all the Indian thing. Now, I just say Kingsley used to hold the handbag. And then, oh gosh, he's he, he talking for money. He want money. And that's all he want. So, if you're talking for a party, they will say that you ain't getting paid. And you're hungry. I just was supporting that political party. And that was like Kamala, you know. I said, Kamala, I said, Kamala, I cannot be supporting you and walking the road, you know, because here, why? If I'm supporting you and they see me with my pants boss, they will criticize me, you know. I say, if I'm supporting you and I'm begging people out here, they will criticize me, you know. So I have to be, I, I don't care. You have to give me something because I don't know after they don't call and say, look what they're doing look what they do this morning. Pastor, they travel, they go on the boat, <laughs> they are taxi, embarrassed here because why? And, and now, if they hear again something, 
Et donc, comment ça, le cas, ils appartent à la petite forme, mamie. Et il dit, quel disent qu'ils peuvent faire Des confans, pas ça. Pourquoi Des as. Des confans. Et les gens understand, et je thank God that you understand, because you're on your radio too long. And you know, sometimes the enemy come a friend, and a friend come here, and enemy after that. Sometimes a friend come here, enemy, and the enemy come a friend. That's why Dr. Rodney said the enemy of my enemy is my friend. Because you know what he was saying. And that's why Dr. Rodney said yesterday, 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 and today, yesterday, and Paz, you said, politics have a majority of his own. So why some people want to take politics to heart and to their grave? These politicians not doing that. It is all about them. Uh, because look at it, Father Google, you think if the government report was bashing the mayor, the mayor of San Fernando, you have to, you would have come and defend him. Ah. You would have come and defend him. Oh. But he went and destroyed you and embarrassed you and shamed you. He called you, you know. Yeah. He called you, you know. Because why? You cannot, you cannot, I got punk. They get fighted. Or they clear up a name. I can pull the game. What can I You are. What can I mean? You are. You should never be the mayor of San Fernando again. Because why is it? The show that is a call PM. I'm not brave enough to take pong. Where's pong? We always get pong. We live with pong. Thank you. You got your pong. You got your pong and you're thinking. They say the worst about me. They say the worst about Pastor Google. And we stand strong. Strong. Strong still. Strong. Look at the things they have done. Things they can't talk. You know what I mean? Ten years old on the radio, I'm getting... But you know what I mean? Only me, I'm shaking the go. Don't, don't care whether they're shaking the go. Because you because know why? I know my reward income for man. It comes from God. Wait I know my reward income for man. And if I am doing wrong, no man could judge me. But I know no God is the only man who could judge things on this earth. No man. But I, I fear all you. That's why I can call it any name. I can call just one name because I am sure. Because I know God. And I know the only man in this world can judge King C. King C. God. I don't care if it's a sad gun. I don't care if it's like I can talk. I go on. Oh, no. Later. Yeah. yeah. Turn so out to big boy out of here. This is my closing song. My daughter's. I go on, I live in here happy today. I live in here joyful today. Let them talk. Let them talk. I out here, children, to be good. God bless you. Talk to you, Monday, please, God. Should make you stronger. So my problems is like.